In continuing coverage tonight, a Valley family is demanding justice after the brother of a Hollywood actress is murdered. 36-year-old Joshua Tao was shot and killed early Sunday morning near Belmont and Backer Avenue. Police say he was there to help someone who had been in a car accident. CBS 47's Kirsten Mitchell joins us live at Fresno Police Headquarters. Kirsten, you spoke with his family. Yeah, Ken, I did, and they are just heartbroken, calling this a heinous, random act of violence. They say he was just trying to help his friend, and he did not deserve this. He's not just a man who died here on these standing rock. His name's Joshua Tao. Pieces of Joshua Tao's life make up a growing memorial at the spot he took his last breath. This is what he likes, his best things. The 36-year-old worked in Fresno as a mechanic. He's someone that if you want help to fix your tire, he'll be there. And he was there Sunday morning helping a friend after an accident. When police say there was an argument between several people at the scene and someone shot Joshua. He was trying to help his friend get home safe. He was worrying about his life, his friend's life. Tao was born in Visalia to a big family, but his sister says he had an even bigger heart. His nieces and nephews sees him like a father because that's who he was to them. If Brooke Chia Tao looks familiar, it may be because she played the mother of Tao and Sue in Clint Eastwood's classic movie Gran Torino. She says since her brother's death, her family is in unimaginable pain. He'll never be a father. He'll never fall in love. He'll never have that chance. Brooke doesn't know who killed her brother or why, but says his life won't be forgotten. We want justice for Joshua Tao and we demand it. And investigators believe several people were there who saw the shooting, so they're really asking people to come forward with information. As for the family, there is a GoFundMe set up to help pay for funeral expenses. I'll post that link on our website, yourcentralvalley.com. Reporting live in downtown Fresno, Kirsten Mitchell, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.